Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the iOS 16.2 Beta 2. Apple has finally released the iOS 16.2 Beta 2. It is finally here. The update was uh, noticeably big on my device. It came at around 2.1 GB on my iPhone 12. And uh, updating my device, I lost around 1 GB. From my device, I had uh, 15 GB available on my device and after installing it, I have 14.1 GB right now. So almost a gigabyte I lost after updating this, uh, updating to this firmware. The number one thing that I was facing, the number one issue was, and a lot of you guys were facing, was Wi-Fi connectivity issues. Even when your Wi-Fi was available, uh, the iPhone was just not automatically getting connected to that Wi-Fi and it was just getting disconnected to the Wi-Fi again and again. That has seemed to be fixed in the iOS 16.2 beta 2, finally. It was a really annoying bug and I'm glad it is finally fixed. Then the wallpaper UI was getting buggy uh, when you were editing uh, doing some edits on the lock screen and changing the lock screen. I uh, changed my lock screen two times really quickly <laughs> and uh, I also edited a lot of it, the part of the lock screen. I had a lot of edits on my lock screen and I managed to bug my device and get a respring. That has seemed to fix right now. So you won't be able to recreate that bug what I talked about on my Twitter with you guys at the rate tech hype. You can follow me on Twitter. I talk about these bugs on my Twitter. So I was able to get my phone restarted while doing this lock screen thingy and that is now fixed on the iOS 16.2 beta 2. The battery is something which is really really early right now to talk about. I mean it's not even been full 2 hours that I have installed this update on my device but I will come up with a lot of videos for you guys to talk about battery life and a lot of things on the iOS 16.2 beta 2 so be sure to subscribe to this channel and turn on notification then some of you guys were talking that uh, is uh, this update bringing some new wallpapers to our device well i have not seen any new wallpapers tell me if you have seen but i haven't seen any new wallpapers and i doubt we will get any new wallpapers anytime soon to be very honest we ain't getting any new wallpapers let's be honest i doubt we will get some new wallpapers uh in future of uh, ios 16 firmware probably ios 17 we will get some new <laughs> wallpapers but not on the 16 i doubt but fingers crossed let's hope so and expect beta 3 to bring some new wallpapers talking about the performance the performance on the ios 16.2 beta 2 seems to be pretty much the same as the beta 1 at the end of the day it is a beta so i don't have high expectations from it but the performance seems to be pretty much the same then compared to the beta 1. Let me know down in the comments below, are you guys interested in uh, Geekbench scores? Because I think I should add the Geekbench scores uh, compared to the previous beta on my videos. Let me know down in the comments below if I should start doing Geekbench scores on my videos. Talking about new features, well, I haven't really discovered any new features right now on the iOS 16.2 beta 2 as of now, but I am sure there must be some of the hidden features in this update and I will be coming up with a hidden features video on my channel really, really soon. So consider hitting that subscribe button and we are so close to 10k. Let's hit that subscribe button right now. Just do it right now. Then AirDrop to Mac. AirDrop to Mac was not working on my iPhone for some reason. Not a lot of you guys were having this issue, but uh, there were one, two, three people out of uh, 10 who were having this uh, transferring to Mac and from Mac to iPhone issues. Basically, AirDrop from Mac or from Mac to iPhone was not working perfectly and it was taking a lot of time for even small things to transfer. And at the end, it was just saying, just open it in files it is just not opening it refuses to send the file to the iphone or from iphone to mac so that is now fixed because i tried it a lot of times and airdrop seems to be finally fixed on the ios 16.2 beta 2 not a lot of you guys had issues related to airdrop on your devices but i did and some of you guys still did like i did talk to some of my friends and uh, most of them didn't have this issue but yes at the same time one 
or two yeah exactly two of them had issues out of 10 uh, yes exactly that is a small percentage but still some of you guys had issues and finally it is fixed in the ios 16.2 beta 2 that's pretty much it for this video if you did like watching this video and watch till the end consider hitting that subscribe button this is me jay aka tech hyped subscribe to this channel right now we are so close to 10k and i want to get to 10k as soon as we can i am jay signing off this is tech hyped one of the fastest people to upload on ios and a lot of apple news so i consider hitting that subscribe button just right now do it do it do it peace out